folks, in today's video, I'm diving into some super amazing apps that you won't find on Google Play Store. We will explore a multitasking powerhouse with a smart dock, a launcher with built-in global search feature, and even a secret weapon to remove bloatware in no time. So stick to the end to discover these hidden gems and supercharge your phone. Kicking off the list with Launcher 14, which is the new kit on the block for Android launchers. And it is making waves with its pixel-inspired design and beefed-up customization features. It's a hit with both tech buffs and everyday users. The game changer here is the no root global search feature, which lets you dig through your contacts, settings, files, and even online content, all without being tied to a specific brand. Privacy is a big deal these days, and Launcher 14 gets it. It brings in Startup Page, a private search engine that is as good as Google, but doesn't hoard your data. Then there is quick switch support for Android 10 and above, which means even if your device isn't rooted, you can still get those sleek launcher recents animations. It also comes up with Smart Spacer SDK to jazz up the at a glance widget with cool animations and horizontal scrolling. And for those who love a clean look, you can now ditch the persistent dock. Plus with new tweaks to icon shapes, packs, padding, colors, size and fonts, you can really make your home screen your own. In short, Launcher 14 isn't just about launching apps, it's a full-on toolkit for revamping your Android experience with top-notch customization, performance boost, and a nod to privacy. It's a must-try for anyone serious about personalizing their Android setup, and you can download it from the link in the description down below, as it is not available on the Google Play Store. Now, if you're aiming to give your Android a desktop-like makeover, Smart Dock could be just what you need. It's a desktop mode launcher that enhances productivity. Now, what really set it apart is its customization options. You can tweak everything from icon and color to shape and system sound, tailoring it perfectly to your own personal taste and workflow needs. The app isn't just about the looks, it's incredibly functional too. Its multi-window support lets you juggle multiple apps at once, much like on your PC, which alongside with keyboard shortcuts dramatically enhances your efficiency. This makes it a top pick for power users. It is also versatile with layouts fit for desktop and tablet modes, and it is compatible with all major Android versions, all without requiring root access. So for anyone looking to power up their productivity on Android, Smart Dock offers a sleek, customizable and powerful experience. For Android users looking to declutter their devices by removing unwanted bloatware apps without root access, Kanta is an effective tool that simplifies this process. The app works in conjunction with Shizuku, a tool that utilizes Android Shizuku service to grant elevated permissions without the need for routing. It boosts a user-friendly interface that makes it easy to swiftly and safely uninstall any installed apps, including annoying blotwares or unused apps that hogs your storage and resources. One of the key benefits of using this app is that it does not require root access, appealing to those who prefer not to delve into technical complexities or risk void their device's warranty. In short, Kanta offers a straightforward and secure method to enhance your Android device's performance and usability by keeping it free from unnecessary applications. Applications. It is an invaluable asset for anyone aiming to maintain a streamlined system without the hassle of rooting. Next up we have Chromite, which is shaking up the web browser game as a Chromium folk that's all about privacy and keeping ads at bay. It is designed to give you a browsing experience that keeps your data away from praying eyes, unlike the usual browsers that are a bit too nosy for comfort. At its core, Chromite's mission is to shut down or strip out any browser's bit that could track you. If tweaking them for more privacy is impossible, they are off by default, but you can flip them on if you want. It's also about cutting the cord between browser and their makers, handling control back to you. It isn't just riding on Bromide's privacy co-trails, it's pushing those boundaries further. It's all about teaming up with other open-source non-profit browsers to build a community that could even sway Chromium's direction. For the average user who want their privacy without going full spy mode, Chromite is a solid bet. It blends ease of use with privacy perks pretty well, making it a strong player among privacy-centric browsers. If you're looking for a streamlined and privacy-conscious way to engage with X, formerly known as Twitter, Quacker might just be the app you need. It is the sleek privacy-focused app you have been searching for to spice up your X interactions. It's all about a clutter-free interface and features that elevate your browsing while keeping it simple and secure. With its material you design, it is not just easy on eye, it syncs perfectly with the latest Android themes, offering light and dark modes to suit your style and settings. It smartly organizes your X activity, letting you effortlessly follow your followings and for you feeds without drowning in content. 
plus the option to group subscription means your experience is customized just the way you like it. Need to go offline? No problem. Quaker's bookmarking lets you save posts for later. And with extras like peeking at trending topics, engaging with polls, and a powerful search feature, staying connected and interactive is a breeze. It's ideal for anyone who wants their social browsing to be straightforward and feature-rich without any fuss. If you're into open source apps and appreciate a neat, straightforward interface for managing your downloads, you might want to check out Droidify. The app shines as a swift material design based F-Droid client that cuts out the unnecessary frills to focus purely on functionality. It's clean design free of distracting elements like elaborate animation and unnecessary cards, offering a refreshing simplicity that enhances usability. A major strength of this app is its rapid repository syncing. Unlike other clients where F-Droid repositories can lag, it efficiently reduces wait time, significantly improving the browsing, updating, and app installation process. It also sticks to standard Android components and keeps dependencies to a minimum, which not only speeds up the app but also minimizes bugs and compatibility issues with different Android versions. Overall, Droidify is a top-notch choice for those looking for a straightforward and effective way to navigate and install open-source software. With its commitment to material design and a focus on efficiency, it's a standout F-Droid client worth trying out. Next up we have Valve, which is your digital safe on Android, offering top-notch encryption for photos and videos. It's a standout app for those who value privacy, providing a secure spot for your memories without being complicated to use. The charm of this app lies in its commitment to privacy with a zero-permission policy, meaning it won't snoop around your device's data. Now this is a breath of fresh air in a world where apps are often too nosy. On-disk encryption keeps your files safe, making it a breeze to backup or switch devices, ideal for frequent updater or backup perfs. Also organizing your media is a snap with its folder system, and if you are juggling work and personal stuff or sharing your device, the multi-vault feature with separate password is just what you need. It is the perfect pick for anyone serious about securing their digital life. For Android enthusiasts longing for the good old days when you could clear all app cache in one go, Cache Cleaner is a godsend. This clever app bypasses the restrictions set since Android Marshmallow, boosting your device's performance and freeing up space without the hassle of clearing cache manually. Now what makes it shine is its no-nonsense approach. It uses the accessibility service to automate cache clearing, saving you a trip to each app setting. Just give it the permission it needs and it will do the heavy lifting, leaving you more time to enjoy a smooth running device. It is not just about automation, it also lets you tailor which app gets their cache cleared. This means apps that bulk up on cache can be kept in check, while those that need their cache for better performance aren't touched unnecessarily. But remember, it's all about balance. Overuse of cache cleaner might slow down app startups as they rebuild their caches, so use it wisely. So guys, these are some of the best and super cool apps that are not available on Google Play Store. So which of the previously mentioned app you like the most? Do you know of any other application that we should have added to this list? Do let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. And for more future videos like this, do consider subscribing and hit that bell icon so that you never miss any future videos from Extreme Droid.